Okay. So let's get this started for today. Move this to the side to see Streamlabs. Move this here so I can watch a video. And move this down just to see chat. Okay, so let's see. Gabe died. She's distraught. Let's see what happens. I'm not big on speeches. And I've always believed that the role of the bartender is to shut up and listen. And by that measure, Gabe was the worst bartender I've ever known. I never issued a speeding ticket to someone on a bicycle before. Till he came along. He cared so much about my admissions essay. Even though he probably couldn't spell admissions <laughs> or essay. <laughs> he booked my band to play the lantern all the way from Seattle to pretty much right where I'm standing. I can recall 14 specific instances where Gabe said something that made me laugh. <laughs> the first was two years ago. So, long story short, instead of a ticket, I ended up buying him a beer. Gabe stood like three feet away, grinning like a doofus at us. I'm sure there were more people, but I only remember him. And then he said, I know, that's why the K is silent. <laughs> uh, and the fifth time, he cared about everyone. He was the kind of guy you wanted to be around. He was a world-class bullshitter. He was my best friend. All I want to say about Gabe is he came into this bar as a stranger, but he left it as family. <clears throat> Guess that's that then. What happened to Gabe? was a senseless, tragic accident. And I just wish it that- It wasn't an accident. Son, now is not the time. Gabe called the mine. I gave him my sat phone to be sure he could get through. They fucked up. And now, now Gabe's dead. That was my shift. If anyone had called, it would have gone through me. Nobody called. You're lying. 
in front of Gabe's own fucking sister. Alex heard the whole thing. He's right. I was there when Gabe made the call. I'd like to hear what you have to say about that, Mac. I'm not saying anything. Just, I didn't get a call. Draw your own conclusions. All right, folks. This is an ongoing investigation. How about that... we review the sequence of events? Hmm? Oh, son. When I saw you at the record store, you seemed pretty eager to find Gabe. Remember why? Hmm? Another fight with Riley, maybe? No, I don't have to take this. Just saying. Pretty wild that you come stumbling out of Gabe's apartment with your face all fucked up. Right. And just a couple hours later, you just so happened to miss the call that would have saved his life. Look, I told you there was no call to miss. And maybe the call got dropped. Oh shit, I mean, it's not like it's not like Gabe was Mr. Reliable all the time. Watch your mouth, Mac. Right, that's enough. Now I'm just as eager as you to understand all this, son, but there was a time. Bullshit, and... Dad. This little weasel's calling Gabe a liar at his own fucking wake. No, I am just telling you. Mac, I swear, if you say there was no call one more fucking time... Stop it! Stop it now! This is not the time or place. We're all here for Gabe. Okay, Ryan? Sure, I'm... I'm sorry. It's not... I'm just... I'm not the one who killed him. Aren't you, though? What the fuck did you just say? Ryan, back off. Oh, I'm hell. just saying. I thought I heard that you Mac, were the one. You shut the hell up. No. No, go ahead. You got something to say, Mac? Let's fucking hear Come it. Come on, guys. Don't make me interview. All right. Fine. As long as we're tossing around accusations, way I hear it, you're the guy who cut the rope. To be honest, the way the rock hit his face, that was a big rock. This is good speed. I mean, it could have been definitely impact, really. Alex? Hey. Fuck those guys. Yeah. Are you okay? Not really. Not what I clicked. I, I will okay, be. that's what I clicked. It's not your job to keep it together. Thanks. Do you... Um... It's messy, but... Do you want to come in? Sure. You play guitar? Sort of. It was a gift. From Gabe. Cool. Gabe would try to pop wheelies outside the record store to make me laugh never worked till he wiped out that was hilarious mm -hmm. 
Gabe really wanted to do the LARP for Ethan. But by the end of it, he was more jazzed about it than anybody. Wish I could have seen it. We took this a year ago. We... No way. I can't. What? We actually kept it. think of it really messed her up I wonder if I could help her the same way I helped Ethan I need to feel her sadness to figure out how to help her really going on with staff. What are they called again? Don't shit on my yard! They're amazing! Their guitarist has one arm! Badass! Uh, no. It's... It's not like that at all. But... It's... I don't know what say this Dude, is like. Dude, give it it's up. Like I thing, already booked a bus ticket. Wait, wait, hear me out. It's one more, more game. This one is more if I win, you levels. have to stay. If you win, I'll cover the ticket. Oh, has you just lost piece. 50 bucks. But it's a fun game so far. Kind of wish it was like Telltale, though. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting your new foosball champion, Gabe Chen. Oh, you're the worst. Can't believe I have to stay in this stupid town. I think we both know you could beat me if you really wanted to. So you're welcome. Bullshit. Anything else to do that on? Damn it! Fucking overpowered blue meteor. Aww, <laughs> is your controller broken too? We're playing until I win. Then I'll be crashing here tonight. Anything else here? How did it get so hot in this fucking room? Here's to your new job at the station. Oh, didn't I tell you? I'm not taking it. I move to Denver next week. You what? I think I know enough to help her now. <sighs> oh, I can believe turned out the wrong way. So is that everything? I'm not missing that. Did to the foosball table. Wait, wait, hear me out. One more game. If I win, you have to stay. Wait, wait, hear me out. Okay. One more game. If I win, you have to stay. Don't 
shit on my yard. They're amazing. Okay, so it's repeating everything, but okay, let's talk to her. Still can't believe he's gone. Yeah. He's the whole reason I'm still. I'm sorry, Alex. I don't like the don't power of the emotions. I don't. I could put on a record if you like. Nah, not really in the mood. Maybe something else? Can I get you a drink or anything? No thanks. I appreciate the offer though. Oh my sure. god, what the fuck do you want? It wouldn't be fool's ball. That wasn't right. It would be. This my drink would be the obvious thing. But she more react to the fool's ball. Let's go with that then. A quick match. Did Gabe tell you we played? I just had a hunch. Yeah? Well, you're right. I don't really think it's a great time. First to five points, if you say so. So, how often did you and Gabe play? It was one of our favorite games. You must be pretty good then. Mm hmm. The fuck? You were in a band, right? Yeah. What'd you play? Drums. What the fuck is this? How uh, how long did you play with them? <sighs> Too long. Gotcha. I have no idea how to play this. Big shocker. Oh, hey, at least you played your best. I mean, that obviously wasn't my best. No, I get it. I mean, this is a tough game. I never played Our football. skill, timing, and the will to be a champion. Oh, is that how it is? Hmm. Wait, hold on. The crowd is really picking up on my energy. You, I want a rematch. Let's go. Let's You're lose. Honest. No fucking clue how to play this. I'm actually trying this time, so you better focus. I am focusing. Good. Wouldn't want you to get distracted or anything. Certainly not. Greatest Northwest band of all time, go. <laughs> Are you trying to distract me? Oh, of course not. Slater Kinney, if you were wondering. I gotta remember which fucking one goes together. Shit. Win. 
was actually trying that time. <laughs> okay, wait, wait, wait. Let's get serious. One more game. Winner takes title of ultimate foosball champion. Mm, I don't know. Come on. You know, Gabe would be all about us playing like this. Well, then it's settled. God, I hate emotions. I really do. <laughs> this is it for all the marbles. So many marbles. Definitely the kind of game you want to focus on, no matter what happens. Totally. Oh, shit. Hey, so are you into girls or what? <laughs> yeah. Girls are pretty rad, right? Especially girls that play foosball and host radio stations and wear beanies. Like it's a religion. <laughs> I gotta remember like which one combo. goes together. Who's what? What? Fuck. <laughs> I knew it. How old are you exactly? Old enough to know better. God damn. In downtown. It. it was a lot of fun. Of course. I need to play more Telltale. <sighs> I think I played everything though. No, I have one more Telltale game to play. What was that shit called again? So, what are you gonna do now? What do you mean? That shit with Mac. He's clearly lying, right? Sam and Max. I'm not sure what Max's deal is. Yeah, Sam and Max His story world. doesn't add up. Yeah. I gotta play that. I do know that I need to find out exactly what happened that night. For myself and for Gabe. I've got your back. No matter what. Thank you. That means a lot. I should head back to work. Cool. I wonder what the twist gonna be in this little show. Usually a twist somewhere. Bye. Bye. I know Gabe made that call, but did Mac really let the blast go off just to get back at him? See? I can be a person. Hey, Shushu. Thanks for sticking around. Wow, well, her bandies be clean. Feels like a million years since that day with Gabe. Hasn't even been a week. Foosball, snowboard. Anything else here that I didn't actually look at? Well, there's some dishes to clean, but that's it. It's Friday. It don't feel like a Friday at all. It's a start. Mm. 
not much to toast at the moment. Let's see, so that's it. That's everything to clean in this place. One of the happiest memories I have. Thanks, Gabe. Wait, is it upstairs? Oh yeah, it's this place. The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. Gabe really loved this place. Gabe was such a dad. But this thing's been up here a while. Isn't that Steph's old van? I bet Gabe could even make golf fun. I'll toss those soon. I swear. Maybe, maybe not. Why look up at the sky when you could look at a sculpture? They're going back downstairs, ain't shit up here. Oh, hey, kid, you don't have to do that. Too late. Wanted to apologize. For all of us. We're all grieving, but that's no excuse. It was your brother's wake, and you both deserve better than listening to a bunch of fools squabble. I appreciate it. That was pretty rough. Although it's hard to imagine a good version of your dead brother's wake. No, there's no good version. Just all of us trying to get through it together the best we can. It wasn't the first wake held in this old building. I doubt it'll be the last. Anyway, if there's anything I can do, just let me know. I feel like he's gonna be a really good asset. I need to talk to asset. Mac. I know he's lying. I just don't know why. Any idea where I can find him? Well, he helps out Eleanor at the flower shop. That'd be the place to start. Thanks. I wonder when she's gonna go down. She has five I chapters. I feel like I should warn you, though. You Oops. might not get the kind of closure you're looking for. If you get any at all. Just... Don't pin all your hopes on Mac Loudon. She has five chapters. She usually... Like, really go down. Thanks for Next looking chapter. out for me, but what else but am I supposed to do? You might get a hint of some shit in this chapter. I wish I had an answer for you. But if you get a chance before you go all dirty, Harry, swing by the dispensary. Charlotte wants to see you. And one more thing. I've been meaning to give you this for the last few days. But I didn't want to disturb you up there. It'll get you through that door 
and the one upstairs. They're too this trustworthy. This is your home now. Like, they just, for as long as you'd like. They just trust her with the keys to his shop and shit. As long as I like? Really? I don't want to make any assumptions or put any pressure on you about what to do next, but... Pressure thought about rent. You're always welcome. Thank you. Give him hell. <laughs> I... I have no idea what to even say to him. Oh, that's a lot of people. If the kid didn't go up there in the first place, shit wouldn't happen. Well, only one she responded to. What am I doing? I bet Gabe would be up here a lot if he wasn't the one taking the pictures. I should put something here. It's the least I can do. They must have been close. Poor Ethan. Gabe Chen. Smooth criminal. Courtesy of Haven's favorite DJ, I bet. I hope Ducky didn't finish this by himself. I wish we'd had more time. I really got bored Maybe of Maybe I can find something upstairs to put on the memory. If I never saw mining equipment ever again, it'd be too soon. Gabe would have appreciated having beer at his wake. And back upstairs to find something to put on the fucking table. Wonder what I can find up here to add to Gabe's memory table. There we go. This is perfect for the memory table. Okay, it went straight to it. Arcade music suck. I don't want to hear it. No, I am fucking tired. I don't even know why. I think I had enough sleep. Glad I have something to add to Gabe's table. Hopefully, things around here can settle down again. Yeah. Uh, RM and TB. I wonder who they were. There's no point for that. Leave. So now I can actually walk around?
Okay, Jed said I might find Mac in the flower shop, but I have time to swing by the dispensary if I want. So I can walk around now. Oh, you heard about the accident. Was it on the news? No, no one. I wonder how many fish Ducky's caught in this thing. So, to be honest, it's like really good art design here. Everything looks nice. Wait, what was that? Hmm. That water over there. That seems kind of suspicious. Nope, leave. There's no music going on, so it's just sitting in quiet. Park looks fun to explore. You're writing a novel? Since when? What if I die tomorrow? Just like that guy. What have I done with my life? I don't have any easy answers for that. Mm, let's see. You live the way you want to. Awful. He was so young. He must be reading about Gabe. I mean, he got hit in the face with a giant ass rock. Everyone needs to stop telling me it's okay. It's not. Hey, buddy. Hey, Alex. Do you want to talk about it? I'm fine. Mm, he's gonna grow with some trauma. Okay, definitely not fine. Everyone needs to stop telling me. I'm here for you. Whenever he, he looks so alone. Cause he is. He's like the only child that I have seen so far. Alright, let's get out of this fucking park. I guess I can finally run. So just walking fast. Cop. Kate was too young. Just too young. Hey, Pike. Hey! Um, how you holding up? Let's go with... I'm okay. I'm okay. Okay is good. I think. His hey, voice is familiar. I want you to know I meant what I said back there. Don't he know why. Something else. He could bring a smile to my face even on the worst days. Yeah. That's what everyone's been saying. And, uh, when you're ready, I still need to get your statement for the investigation. I think I'll be ready soon. Yeah. Yeah. No rush. <sighs> Alright, who else to talk to? I used to babysit Ethan when he was little. This whole thing is literally nothing I can do for Ethan. I feel so useless. I've been there. Alright, that's enough of this spot. It's looked rough. This location gets all the foot traffic. Oh, customers here are a lot nicer than in Denver. Never been to Denver, but I guarantee they're nice here. Let's see, your flower shop what is down there. Accident? 
It's bullshit. We have a right to know what's happening to our jobs. I can type in eight years of my life. And they can't give me back one simple answer about my job. Typhon doesn't give a shit about anyone. Yeah, because they won't tell us a damn... I just still can't... Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk to me. Dispensary. So, anyone seen Loudon? Sorry about today. Oh, there it is. It's do not you your fault. Want to do something together next week? Come on, man. Can't you take a hint? She's not into you. Let it go. That's rough. If I tell him I like him, we'll date, and then we'll break up, and then I'll lose my best friend. Of Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk to me. I usually grab a bite with okay, oh, sorry. We met briefly. You're Gabe Chen's sister, right? Alex, yeah. I didn't know him well, but I could tell he had a big heart. I'm so sorry for your loss. That's not what she needed to hear. That's a weird painting. Ah, dispensary. Gotcha. Charlotte? Alex? Hey. Jed said you wanted to see me. Ah, she sells I drugs. I gotcha. wanted to see how you were doing. I'm okay. Keeping my chin up. Sometimes that's all you can do. How about you? I can't even imagine what you're going through. Honestly, I'm really trying to keep it together for Ethan. He's hurting. He does seem distant. He practically just lost father. But he's shutting me out. He's never done that before. Not when it mattered. He's a pretty insightful kid. He knows how much you're hurting, even when you try to hide it from him. Instead of trying to be strong, maybe the best thing you can do is show him that it's okay to hurt. That's really helpful, Alex. Thank you. I can't get over the feeling that the one person who could help me deal with the aftermath of Gabe's death is Gabe. What is this? An affidavit from Typhon. If I sign, I'm agreeing not to press charges in exchange for a payment. A big one. That's so shady. Why would they be offering you money if they didn't do anything wrong? They say it's an offer of good faith. Good faith just giving them but money. you're right. He's dead because of them. And I'd be letting them off. Are you going to sign it? I don't know. I'm trying to put Ethan first, but... 
What would you do? Do you think it would be a betrayal of Gabe? Y'all wasn't married. Why are they even doing it anyway? You see, take the money for Ethan. Makes sense. Financial stability, all that. Be a hippie, fight for Gabe with no money. For Ethan. You have to put Ethan first. If the money helps, I think you should take it. Thanks, Alex. That means the world. I mean, she can press that charges. That affidavit feels scummy, but Ethan should come first. That's what's funny. I really appreciate you stopping by. Sweet logo. Bet Charlotte designed it herself. I really love Charlotte's style. God. Put some clothes. When did you. Nope, Stairway to Haven? Believe it or not, Gabe named that one. She said it's not betrayal. Still makes me feel sick. Same. I'm always here for you if you need anything. Thanks. Back at you. Alright, let's leave this little awful place. Still need to check the flower shop for Mac. Okay, let's go back to these people. Some shit just went down. Man, these overnight shifts really take it out of me. Yeah, and let's talk about the accident. How would I know that? Fuck, now I'm on Diane's shit list. Thanks, Diane. Huh. So, Diane, don't talk about the accident, huh? Steph asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. Sure. Heavy ass footsteps. What's the next game I should play? I have two already lined up. Steph asked me to swing by. Which order She's gotta go? be around here somewhere. She's not select. There it is. How could Chrissy leave me? After everything we've been through together. It's hard to beat breakup music. But maybe I can find something around here to cheer him up. I'm glad Gabe convinced her to stay. Hey, I'm glad you stopped by. I've only got a sec, but... Have you talked to Ethan at all? Ethan. Talked is maybe too strong a word. I tried. He's taking it really hard. But what you did for me this morning got me thinking. What if Ethan needs something like that too? Something fun and distracting. Something like a LARP. Like the one you and Gabe were gonna take him to? Yeah. But designed just for him in Thanor. He'll love that. Yeah, I'm glad you think so. I need your help though. I want it to be as good as it can be. Ethan gave you one of his comics, right? So, what do you think? Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun defeating? I need her character models to blink. Cause she looks creepy. Let's see. I'm gonna go what looks better. Let's not do something that involves death. Stormrider looks like a worthy opponent. He gets my vote. 
All right, then. Oh, I, I gotta get back in there. There's some stuff in my comp book. It'd be cool if you could check it out. Help me make some calls. I'll see what I can do. I'm like, for real, she's not blinking. Hey, uh, Haven listeners. That was Phone Tap with their new single, Elephant in the Room. The breakup section, huh? That's rough, buddy. Oh. Looks like Steph wants me to do more than just make some decisions. She wants me to play a bard. Of course she does. I guess I'm in. Let's start with my name. Mission is free this year, so bring your friends, bring your family. Hell, mm. bring your ex. I'm sure it'll be different this time. What should the name be? Alexandra sounds basic. Let's go with this one. Alto is a good name for a bard. Ability time. Distortion field sounds fun, but healing serenade could really come in handy. Huh. You always need more healers. But they're both support. <laughs> Let's go with. Which one should it be? Which one should it be? Distortion field sounds fun. Healing field sounds. But well, healing serenade sounds. Like it sounds boring. Fuck it. Become a healer. Healing serenade it is. How did I meet Thanor? It was a dark and stormy night. Of course it is. This LARP thing just might work. So that it? Okay. Let's take a flower shop. That's the only thing I gotta do. Val, I just want to be friends. I do want to pet the cat. When can I pet the cat? Gabe was hoping I'd get back into playing. Maybe I will. Still need to check the flower shop for me. Flower shop over there. It's fine. I love being on hold. I love this song. Oh, Final. wrong spot. Eleanor? Oh! <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> no need to apologize. How are you, dear? Oh. 
I'm, um... Why do I keep have to say I'm okay? I'm okay, I guess. Taking it one moment at a time. It's the best way to be. Uh, is Mac here? Oh, he was helping me not too long ago. I think he just left. Can't have gotten too far. <laughs> Got it. Thanks. Now, what was I? Hmm. And talk to her because you feel her emotions. She looks terrified. I can't leave her like this. Okay, so I gotta go around the counter to help her or some shit? Okay. Time to figure out why she's afraid. All my memories are fading. Are fading. I feel, I feel broken. broken. <sighs> okay. Anything else other than just the register? If Riley, Riley finds, finds out, out, she can't, she can't find, out. find out. Okay, so she's mm. losing the flower shop? Or is she losing her mind? Thank you, dear. I'll get started on it right away. Just come by with the check whenever you're free. Shit, that's what's going on. Oh, that was something. The doctor said I had more time, yep. but everything is becoming so out of order. Okay, I won't go back to playing Overwatch. I just don't feel into it. I feel I feel broken. Skip. All right, let's talk to this girl. How does she hide all of this? With a smile and a positive attitude. So I'm missing something else. None else in here. None of the pictures. Still can't talk to her. The doctor says I had more time. Okay, over here. There we go. If they know about my condition, they'll make me close this place. There we go. Holy shit.
not just that she forgot what she was doing. She's afraid she's forgetting everything. And health. Forget what you were working on? <laughs> you could say I'm having a bit of a senior moment. <laughs> well, maybe I can help. You could focus on something else for a bit and see if it comes back. I suppose. But I can't help feeling like it was something important. Whatever it was. Seems like you have a lot going on today. I could help you retrace your stats. Oh, I, I don't want to keep you. the sign to open I always flip it first thing when I come in and then I open my mail something must have distracted me better we can do this okay so I gotta figure out what's next and she opened her mail that's not the mail register you were over here when I came in maybe you were counting the drawer I would have done that last night something distract her what will distract her from here flowers did you trim these flowers today you don't have to do this. I'll be alright on my own. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. Okay, so what after that? Not the register, not the flowers. Was it a phone call? Could a phone call have distracted you? Yes. There I got a call first thing in the morning. I can't think who it was. Maybe we can find something to remind you. Third? Could it have been Riley who called? I think that's right. She called to tell me about a new order. Goodness. What was the order for? in here so now would it be the flowers rush order this must be what Riley came in for I think that order might have been for these lilies of course Riley helped me pick them out before she left. Now we just have to figure out who ordered them. And then, let's see, after that. Would it be the register? Because it's the last thing. The check for the lilies would be in here, right? That could tell us who bought them. Should. Mr. Jedediah Lucan. Huh. It's $89 for some flowers? Oh my god. Looks like the lilies are for Jed. 
That's right. Riley dropped off an order for Jed. I knew you'd figure it out. I couldn't have done it without you. Jed must be hosting some event. I wonder why he wants lilies, though. They're traditionally for funerals. God. She doesn't remember. She already you know what to all that shit. Probably doesn't know the difference between a lily and a tulip. <laughs> <laughs> Don't sell him short. He's more clever than he seems. Let's leave her to be happy. Thanks again for your help. Don't be a stranger. I won't. Promise. She was finally feeling better. Of course, they didn't want to ruin it. All right, now where am I going? Do record stores still exist? Eleanor said Mac is nearby. I don't see him here. Maybe at the bridge? Huh. I need a map. <laughs> Might tell more to go. Too bad I can't just run away from all this. Okay, not this way. How's your progress in Moondrop Ranch? Let's see. Okay, now yes. Okay. Did you buy your chicken coop? There you are. Mac. Alex. Look, it's not a good time. You owe me an explanation about what happened to Gabe. What? Costing me my girlfriend wasn't enough for you? Now you're gonna accuse me of killing Gabe too? I get it. He died on your shift, and you're freaked. But you have to come clean. Please. There's nothing I can tell you. Mac, come on. He was my big brother. I can't. Something definitely has him scared. Maybe if I could tap into his fear, I could get to the truth. Of course you can. I just need to find something I could use to push him over the edge. Everyone's out to get me. Alex, Ryan, even Riley. Fuck! Even Riley? Did something happen with her? Hmm. Everyone's out to get me. Alex, Ryan. We're done here. Talk to Riley about Max McFear. Now, where does Riley work? No, where is she at, I should say. So much easier. She just fucking can call. I don't get it. Do people just not want to have to keep up a brave face for Angela? She loves our store so much. He must be exhausted. We're losing our business, but it's like everything's a joke to him. She must feel so alone. Hope they figure it out. 
Nothing says festive like three exclamation points. Where will Riley be? Just around the corner. Sponsored by Typhon Mining. Better. Pirate Peaches is making an actual profit, remember? I just need to find something I could use to push him over the edge. Let's see. Fine arts. Did they tell me where she's at? I just didn't listen. I mean, that's a possibility, but. stutter it just did but whatever nope she's not here she won't be upstairs I could just look it up simple is quick and easy just need to find something I could use to push him over the edge. Nope. They didn't feel like painting the mine. Let's check the dispensary. Are these people? That's where she's at. Like, where was she supposed to go? <sighs> Let's try to park. These loaded screens. Need to too find much. something I could use to push him over the edge. Not that way. Wait. No, wait, what's well, this way? Oh, sorry. You're fine. Separate guy, Ethan. I 
haven't been a bartender long, but I'm pretty sure these are supposed to stay in the bar. All right, not here. I wish they'd tell me where is it. She not this way. Insert epiphany about new beginnings here. Me personally will stomp on those flowers just because I could. Fuck new beginnings. She's not in the record store. Bald guy. Yikes. Oh, he angry. He angry, angry. All right, let's go here. Let's see if she knows. She was finally feeling better. I didn't want to ruin that. Right, let's see. I hope you find Mac. Thanks. I hope you find Mac. I hope it's good news. Oh God, they're multiplying. All right, so she's she don't know shit. I don't know shit. Photos, orchid. Everyone wants an orchid until they realize how much work it takes to keep them alive. Kind of like foster Alzheimer's. That's awful. Okay, so I'm just going back to Mac. I just need to around. find something I could use to push him over the edge. Can't go that way. Everyone's out to get me. Alex. Ryan, even Riley. Fuck! Talk to Riley about Max Fears. Where the fuck is Riley? I feel sick. I'm done. Where's Riley? <sighs> First one pops up. Okay, thank you. She 
it would be here. If he's innocent, why is he acting like this? Acting like what? Maybe. Hey, Riley. Alex. Hey. You and Eleanor seem close. She's taken care of me ever since I was little. I never really knew my mom, but she's always been there for me. What does she think about you going away to school? She's thrilled. <laughs> I think she just wants me to end up happy. That's really sweet. She's the most selfless person I know. I know having you work with her in the shop has meant the world. Yeah. To both of us. <laughs> uh, go with Gabe. I know you and Gabe were close. How are you doing? I miss him so much. He was like an older brother to me. Let's go with that. I'm glad he had you. Thank you, Alex. Really. That fight Mac had with Gabe over your secret meetings. They were about you applying to college, right? Yeah. Ever since the first time Mac lost his shit in front of them, Gabe and Charlotte had tried to get me to end things with him. And after all this, I can see that they were right. Do you think he could have ignored Gabe's call? I mean, do you think he's capable of that? I don't want to believe that, but... Sorry, I'm really not ready to talk about it. Yeah, I get it. It's just... If he didn't do anything wrong, why is he acting like he has something to hide? He asked me to leave Haven with him. What? Right after the wake. He wouldn't tell me why. But he just looked so guilty. I told him no. And that we were done. And now... I'm scared. He did something horrible. Riley. Thank you for telling me. You deserve the truth. I gotta run. There's some stuff I need to do. Okay. We'll talk soon? Yeah. When Whenever you want. Alright, confront him. Mac trying to skip town is sketchy as shit. I bet I could use that to stoke his fear. I should make sure there's nothing else I want to do before I confront Mac. Oh, I did everything. Everyone 
Riley's out to get me. Alex? What Riley told me might do it. But I should make sure there isn't anything I still want to do around town first. Nope. Okay. Let's do this. Your ex-girlfriend told me about your plans to skip town. That's not something innocent people do. Oh God. It's not... I didn't do anything. <sighs> Fuck off! <laughs> Leave me alone! as hell. So now she's like she's being watched. Oh. I'll deal with Mac when I get to him. For now. Typhon's always watching. They run this whole town. Feels like everyone's staring at him. Everyone thinks I killed him. They all hate me. Loser. <laughs> it's not fair. I didn't do anything wrong. It should have been you instead. Try to help. And they know the way they looked to beat the wake. They all think I let him die. I know why you're lying. Typhon's forcing you to deny the call. you tried to stop it. They fucked up, not you. Stop lying for them! You don't get it. This wasn't some accident. I told them you were down there, and they detonated anyway. On purpose? Why? I don't know. I swear. And then I get a message telling me to deny there was ever a call. You gotta believe me. Gabe and I, we didn't get along, but I, I didn't want him dead. And now, now Typhon's watching me. My girlfriend, she, she thinks I'm a murderer? My neighbors all hate me? What, 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 okay, yeah. what the down. fuck am I supposed to do? I think I can calm him down, but does he deserve it? Kind of, yeah. Don't take it too far. All right, Mac. Come on. You got to calm down, okay? Dude, stay with me. I know what it's like to be doubted. To have everyone think the worst of you. But the truth will come out. I'll make sure of it. But Typhon... If Typhon comes after you, they're gonna have to get through me too, okay? Thanks. 
I actually feel a little better. <laughs> yeah, well, you learn a thing or two hanging out with shrinks your whole life. <laughs> So, what are you going to do now? Don't leave Haven. I'm going to get to the truth. I wonder who's the head honcho type. Let's talk to the ranger guy. Hey. Yeah, it's... Can we talk? Where are you? Okay. I'm gonna do a chapter a day. But I think we're gonna probably do these on the weekdays. Weekend is gonna be probably Twitch. So. Yo, fucking god, it's fucking hot. It's really uncomfortable. And it's really not helping that this shirt swunk in the fucking washing machine. Really isn't helping. You were right. About Typhon, about Mac. Alex. Mac got the call. How do you know that? He got the call and he lied about it. Doesn't matter. Someone is putting pressure on him to keep quiet. Someone from the mine and- It doesn't matter. I keep- Coming here and playing it back, but it always ends the same. Ryan, he's dead. He's really dead, Alex. I'm trying to get the, the voice acting. This is I need a little more motion on that. Something like that. Whatever the audio is doing is really fuck with me. my fault my job is to keep people safe and I failed I mean you can't you don't have force power you can't block a rock you saved Ethan that kid is alive right now because of you she's wrong I let her cross that log I put Gabe in harm's way I'm not a hero I'm a coward Worse than worthless. I know what it's like to feel worthless and helpless. I but we saved you over the scene. And you saved me. It doesn't matter. Gabe's dead because of me. I'm so sorry.
Gabe loved you, Ryan. He would forgive you. You know that. <laughs> You're not alone. There, like, if I felt that, would he die? Whoa, whoa hold on. <laughs> There's a guy in a gorilla suit. <laughs> Does he also jump off of the cliff and into the pool? No, no, he chases a guy in a banana suit. That guy jumps off the cliff and into the pool. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. This is a Mexican restaurant, eh, nominally. <laughs> <laughs> the food is uh, well, terrible, but it's Gabe's favorite place. I tell you, he's the oldest 12-year-old I know. Can I ask you something? Of course. You came up here to tell me that I was right about Mac. About him getting the call. How did you know? There's something you should know about me. And it's gonna be easier to show you than to explain it. This is gonna seem sort of weird at first, then really weird. Do you trust me? So level of detail in those mountains is really nice. Okay, think of something sad, like breaks your heart sad. Really focus until you feel it. said you'll never hear it again. Ugh. Never a dull moment. <laughs> the kinds of stuff we got up to. <laughs> this is all happy. We're going to send him off right this time. Whatever it is you're thinking about right now, don't stop, okay? Keep going. Okay. <laughs> She's like a super what emotion therapist. Is this? <laughs> How deep you think? 
<laughs> deeper than that, the Royal Canadian Mounted Police can spot a goose grave at a hundred paces. <laughs> the Mounties? <laughs> oh, come on, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. How long were you going to let me dig? <laughs> well, I wasn't going to stop you. <laughs> That's a lot of blood, huh? Gabe, this is serious. <laughs> Killing a Canadian goose is a violation of international law. Shut up! It is not. They're Canadian geese, Gabe. The property of the crown. The... the crown of... <laughs> property of the crown, Gabe. <laughs> what do we do? Okay, then there's the duck. Or goose. Gabe, goose. I see it. It'll move. <laughs> it's not moving. <laughs> It'll move. Gabe! <laughs> so, <laughs> did you finish burying the goose or not? <laughs> okay, also, property of the crown. <laughs> really? <laughs> well... They are technically protected under the Migratory Bird Treaty Act. <laughs> <laughs> How? So... I guess I have this... power. I can see other people's emotions. They show up like an aura, and if I get too close, I... I feel what they feel. As if I was feeling it myself. And when I focus, I can even understand why they're feeling it. And that's what you just did with... With me? Whew. Some kind of power. No kidding. It's... It's only ever been the bad emotions before. But... That... That was... Pure joy. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she was in the city. There's a lot of negative emotions there. Who else knows? Gabe did, but now I guess just you. And that's how I know Max terrified of Typhon. He reported Gabe's call and they ignored it. Now they're putting pressure on him to toe the line. Okay, but why? I don't know yet. Someone made the decision to let the blast go off. Seems like finding out who would be a good start. So, you're going after Typhon? You'll need help. You don't have to. You're stuck with me now. Keep professional. Okay then. Team up. Do the buddy cop thing. <laughs> You're a loose cannon, Chen. But you get results. <laughs> hmm. I'm not feeling the characters. I'm just not feeling it. Like, I'm, I'm hearing the story. I understand the story. I'm just not feeling it. Don't know why. 
again, the first Life is Strange, I felt the story, I understood the story. Before the storm, that too. I didn't really play two, but at the beginning of it, I felt the story. On this one, this it one's just, for you, Gabe. Just not feeling it. I miss you. Don't know why. Maybe because of powers of bullshit? I don't know. Oh, fuck that. Like, before I started streaming, it was, like, moderate warm. Now it's like I'm in a fucking sauna. They can at least put some over the license music. Like if they have a switch to go wait. Do this shit. I didn't speak this morning. I couldn't. Hearing everyone talk about him. About the life he had here with all of you. I lost the chance to have that. But even though I only had one day with him, he changed my life. I said, I didn't know if I belonged here. He told me that home isn't something you find. It's something you build. Gabe. Yeah, no, okay. Let's turn this fan a little bit better this way. Oh wow, this fan's hitting me with hot air. The fuck? Open up this fucking window. Get that fucking winter air. There's multiple people in this town. Oh, yep, yeah, something to do with her. Did she give off the order? Like, the only thing I can think good about her powers is, like, she can know who's lying or, like, know who to trust. Okay. He counting down. Got about Eleanor Duh. Okay, yep. People really wanted to make her sad, but okay. Have a sign of an agreement. Take the money, find another way to do the shit. Again, she can do a lawsuit as well, not just her. Ah, oh, I missed something. Okay, so there was only a photo and an album. There was a dartboard? Let's back Ryan's claim at the wake. Alex offered Ryan gave forgiveness. I guess that was the right choice, it seems. Ryan and Alex shook hands at the wake. Hit a ravine on it. Nah. Alex claimed the title of football champion. Really? Who let her win? Stuff me, Stormers, Lark Boss. Guess I've made the right choice of some people. Goddamn. 
only one percent didn't talk to her. I was gonna help. Oh no! Wait, I could have helped her for why? I was didn't help the sad dude. There was a way to help these people. It was no nothing popped up to help them. Calm down. Yep. That's it for the day. Wasn't even two hours. Okay, this, this one was shorter. Okay. Catch me on Twitch. I'm doing Overwatch. Tomorrow. I'm not going to be doing this. I'm not going to stream this tomorrow. I'm going to stream this on a Monday. Yeah, I'm going to stream this on Monday. Then I'm going to stream Overwatch. Maybe some Star Wars tomorrow as well. Really depends on how I feel. Maybe do both. 